Saitama, the One Punch Man conditions apply, recently used his serious table flip to flip Io, one of Jupiter's many moons, inside out, pretty much. Now, while Io does end up being completely destroyed, looking at how it ended up, we can't assume that Saitama actually surpassed its gravitational binding energy as its gravity is still acting on the moon's fragments so that they still retain its general shape, just way more spaced out. However, by taking the moon's volume of 25.319 billion cubic kilometers and a typical rock density, as Io is made of silicate material, which also makes up much of Earth's surface, we can find that Saitama must have produced about 417 petatons of TNT to fragment the moon like this. Now, while this is rather small for a planetoid's destruction, remember he is not surpassing the moon's binding energy, which is on a much higher level. The Sirius tail flip not only wrecked the moon, but also launched the moon's wreckage into space. But looking at this image and comparing the distance the farthest rocks were thrown to the diameter of the planet, and Satama ends up having thrown them over 2,438 kilometers into space. Assuming that the entire mass of the planet ended at a similar distance, just in different directions, and that it took about 15 seconds to reach that distance, the fragments must have been moving at about 417 times the speed of sound. So, moving the entire mass of Io at this speed, and Saitama should have produced about 282 zeta-tons of TNT. This is more than enough to destroy planet Earth six times over. However, this would be if you were on the receiving end of the moon getting thrown at this speed. The power to get the moon moving at this speed from a standstill would likely end up doubling the power that Saitama must have used. Wait a minute, hold on. This is several thousand times greater than the binding energy of Io. The fragments are still clearly under the effects of the moon's gravity, but he also clearly generated enough power to overpower the binding energy of the moon. Guys, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to stop thinking about this before I go mad. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but then again, that's not unusual for One Punch Man. So guys, thanks for watching. See you next time. Remember to stay spectacular. Jojo, out.